The top of the show, the first part of the show, is dedicated to the H-Town area teams, the Houston area colleges, first and foremost, my alma mater, the University of Houston, the Houston Cougars, proud alum, graduate of UH back in December of 1994. First things first, got to say this, there's not much progress being made regarding the new AD. I was told, I heard Tuesday, that Houston has not even begun the interview process yet regarding the new AD, the opening for the athletic director job. Yes, one more time. They haven't even begun to interview candidates for the AD job. I hope that they will have the hire by the time of the start of the college football season in August. Was it August 31st, the Cougs' first game of the year? Between now and then, hopefully, it's not very promising. Things I'm hearing, the, the some of the baffling thought process behind the candidates, the contract offers, things of that sort. It it's it sounds like Mama Mater is still acting like they are a small time program rather than a power four program. So it it's just I love them. But I love them enough to critique them when they're wrong. Rex, good afternoon to you. Thank you, as always, for chiming in. Yes. So apparently, UH got rid of an AD before having an idea of a replacement. Yes, that's what it sounds like. That's what it seems like. And if you missed it earlier, very top of the show, UH has not even begun interviewing candidates for the athletic director job. Yes, they have not yet begun interviewing. Heard that on Tuesday. I don't know if things changed as of Wednesday or Thursday, but as of Tuesday, I was told they had not yet begun interviewing anyone for the job. I hope that a new AD is hired by the start of this football season. But from what I'm hearing, the low ball offers, the piss poor monetary offers are not helping this process to get quality candidates. You, gotta, you want top candidates, sometimes you got to pay for it. And that has not been the case so far from what I'm hearing. So that'll do it. Wrap it up. Kudos to my man, Adolphus A.D. Moore, for joining me as part of the Houston Round Ball Review Media Group. Subscribe to this channel, Houston Round Ball Review. Thank you to A.J. Jones. Download the BS3 Network app on Roku. You watch the show there as well. So everyone, thank you to Rex32 and CA37 for their questions and comments. See you again in a few days next, next Thursday. If you're in town, see me, join me Tuesday at Fertitta Center for Forever Cougs against Team Colorado in the round of eight. Until then, keep this in mind. Since 1994, the Houston Round Ball Review. Local name, global perspective. Everyone, take care. Peace.